Now there's an offer I didn't expect. If you really want to help, I'm looking for someone who can handle themselves in a public setting. As in someone who knows how to get the job done without shooting up the place. Do you really think I'd be offering you a job without pay? This isn't my first rodeo. I politely requested a list of supplies from Gennady Ayton at the clinic and was told the price of business has gone up. I think he's back on Aurora and he's upcharging me to pay for it. And if there's one thing I'm not going to do is subsidize his habit. I want you to make sure he delivers my supplies for the price we agreed on, but without raising any alarms. We'll see. Talk is one thing, actions are another. Oh yeah, the funny thing is, he's the poster boy for upstanding moral citizens. Top of the class at nursing school, did volunteer work in backwater settlements, a reputation you could eat your food off of. Nobody knows he did it all zoned out of his mind. Nobody except his old boss, me. He said he got clean when he joined the clinic, but now I wonder. A bullshit one, yeah. Gennady claims prices have gone up for the clinic as a whole, and that I'm not the only doc being hit. He says if I want cheaper goods, I'm going to have to find another supplier. He even gave me a list. But I'm not turning to some third-rate doc selling meds out of their space truck. Gennady and I had a deal, and I want him to honor it. Take care of yourself. Need something? I'm just a courier. I understand that. I'm not blaming you directly. Dr. Salvato, how long have you been here? Uh, about a year now, Doctor. And in that year, how many times have we had this conversation about late or missing shipments of supplies? I believe this is the third time. Yes, that sounds right. Three times. <clears throat> I will be making it very clear to your superiors that lives are at stake, and the clinic requires reliable transport. If your company cannot meet our needs, someone else will. Uh, yes, ma'am. Uh, understood. Thank you, Dr. Salvato. You may return to your duties. Running this facility is a challenge, even when there isn't enough. Mind your step. Floors in here can be a bit slick at times. Don't ask why. Is there something I can help you with? You look a bit lost. Damn. You're fleet, aren't you? I should have known she'd send someone. Look, the price of goods here has gone up. Doubled. Tripled, even. Did she not even consider a cheaper supplier? She really should. I know we had a deal, but the fleet don't like paying a premium. I was hoping she'd take the hint and find another supplier. It's just, 
I hear about people getting treated or dying all the time due to run-ins with the fleet. How does it all shake out in the end, I don't know. Either way, it seems like I end up with lives on my conscience. Yeah? Advice from the fleet? I doubt it. It's not that I doubt the use. It's the motives of the people being saved. Uh, I can't argue with that. I don't want to deny anyone help that truly needs it. I don't want to disappoint anyone. That's my problem. And I do consider her a friend. I think you've convinced me. Still, I can't believe I made a deal with the Crimson Fleet. I've stashed the supplies in the storage closet just around the hall. Here's the key. Just try not to let anyone see you. I want to keep this as under the radar as possible. Whatever you do, don't unplug anything. You do, and I'll make sure you wind up in one of these hospital beds. <laughs> I'm kidding, kidding. Sort of. These poor people. I can't imagine suffering from something no one understands. It must be terribly frightening for them. Just be really sure before you commit to it. Really sure. I hand it to these doctors. They put in a lot of hours. I'm probably fine. Yeah, I'm fine. I hate this thing. Can't ever get here fast enough. If he doesn't come through with those supplies, we're screwed. At least until Shinya pinpoints a shipment. Tell me you've got those supplies from Gennady. I'm on the last of my med packs here. Well, next time I won't even question it. I might have to make this a regular thing. At least it's one way to get guaranteed supplies. I only need to determine Gennady's limits. 
I'd hate to break him. That's the way, isn't it? I just feel more comfortable knowing Gennady was handling it. No offense, but I don't envision the fleet to be very efficient with a shopping list. Well, I'll arrange your payment so you can get out of here. I appreciate the help. 